Good morning, my name is Devante. How can I help you today? Um, I actually saw this job uh, posting and I was actually interested in the job and I had some additional questions. Oh, sure, okay. What questions do you have? I can help. the duties of the job and what it looks like, what it entails. For sure. So we do have two different job positions. Okay. One will be janitor E, and this is more of an experience level. So your job will be to perform a full range of janitorial assignments using limited judgment. And actions are normal normally determined by instructions for a supervisor. <clears throat> Can you repeat, so that's for janitor E, correct? Yeah, that's for janitor E. So you'll be working with the supervisor. And then also we have janitor A, which is the supervisor. So then you'll be able to, over, the supervisor oversees and instructs the, the janitors what to do and like to use the right chemicals, what to clean, things of that nature. So I need some clarification um, for so for janitor E. Uh, you mentioned that uh, jan janitor E has more of uh, has more experience, but is actually with a supervisor. Um, I'm kind of a little bit confused. If you can expound on that a little bit, please. For sure. So janitor E is more of, can you clean with the proper chemicals? Do you know how to clean the windows, the floors? However, you need a supervisor to tell you where to go. Is there any more questions? Like, do you need more descriptions? Okay, for janitor A, mm -hmm. um, I will be responsible for uh, supervising janitors that are under me, correct? That's correct. So, as the statement reads, it's janitor A, this is advanced level. As a crew leader, the, the employee participates in overseeing work of lower level janitors. And that's A, correct? Yeah, that's A. <clears throat> so 
So I was curious to know for those and those two positions are currently open, correct? That's right. Okay. What are the requirements for each of them? Do you need to have a high school degree, a degree, a post secondary degree? What are what what does it entail for the requirements of each position? It looks like for here to be a supervisor, you just not you need to know how to manage a team, learning how to work with others beneath you. And then for janitor E, the criteria is that you're able to utilize those functions like how to clean. Um, we do require at least a high school diploma, but other than that, as long as you know how to clean and take direction, you should be fine. Um, hourly rate? Hourly rate is about ten dollars an hour for a janitor E, and then it would be fifteen dollars an hour for janitor A. $15, correct? Yes, because one is supervisory, one is more frontline staff. interested in applying for the supervisor position because I do have some management skills. Um, I actually wanted to, curious to know, how many hours per week for that position? Sure. So for the supervisor position, you will still be required to work 40 hours a week, but you will supervise various teams. started with the application process. Sure, sure, wonderful. All right. 